Welcome back to Hype Tech Official Channel. In today's tutorial, we have an exciting topic lined up for you. We'll be diving into the world of Windows Server 2012 R2 and Active Directory to create two user groups within the sales department and deny all users within the sales department except the senior staff. By the end of this tutorial, you'll have the knowledge to control user access and enhance security within your organization. If today is your first time of watching my tutorials, kindly like and subscribe to this channel for more. So, without wasting much time, let's get started. First things first, let's create the user groups for our sales department. To do this, press on the Tools button and select Active Directory Users and Computers. Drop down on the domain. I have already created two user within the sales department, Mike and John. So, in case you don't know how to create an OU or a user, just right-click on the domain and select New, then select Organizational Unit or User from the drop-down menu. Now, we are going to create two groups, Senior Staff and Junior Staff for the users within the sales department. To do this, right-click on the sales department's Organizational Unit, OU, and select New and then Group. Let's name our first group Senior Staff and our second group Junior Staff. Now that our groups are ready, we will have to move the users into their respective groups. John is a senior staff and Mike is a junior staff. To move a user into a group, right-click on the user and select Add to a group. Type the name of the group that you want to add the user to. So, we are going to add John to the senior staff group and Mike to the junior staff group. Now, let's check to see if the users are in the groups. Great! Now that we have added the users to their respective groups, let's create a group policy object GPO, that will restrict all users within the sales department except the senior staff. To do this, click on the Tools button again and select Group Policy Management. Now, drop down on the Forest Domain. Now, let's move on to the sales department specific GPO. We want to deny access to removable storage devices for all users except the senior staff. Following the same steps as before, we'll create a new GPO named GPO Removable Storage Restrictions and link it to the sales department's OU. You can name it any name as you want.
Great. We have created our new GPO. So, the next thing that we need to do is to right click on the newly created GPO, select edit. Once in the group policy management editor, we'll navigate to user configuration policies administrative templates system removable storage access. Here, we can customize the policy settings to deny access to removable storage devices. Now, select dot all removable storage classes. Deny all access and right click on edit. Here, select the enable then click on apply and OK. Now, close this window. Excellent. With the GPO applied, all users within the sales department will be restricted from accessing removable storage devices. Now, we are going to use the security filtering to exclude groups or users that we don't want them to be affected with this policy within the sales department. To do this, double-click on the newly created GPO and go the security filtering. Here, we have authenticated user. What it means is that all users who have logged in with a username and password are going to be affected. Now, because we want to allow only the senior staff to have access to removable storage devices, we will select and remove authenticated user and add only the junior staff group and exclude the senior staff. Excellent. With the GPO applied, all users within the sales department will be restricted from accessing removable storage devices, except for the senior staff members. Now, let test to see if the GPO that we applied worked or not. I'm going to log in with the credentials of the users that I created, Mike and John, to see which user had the access of removable storage devices and who did not. I'm logging in as John, who is a member senior staff. Now, open command prompt. Now, type GP update force. This command is used to force group policies to be updated. Now, I'm going to inset a flash drive. Great. John, who is a member of the senior staff group, had access to removable storage devices.
Now let log in as Mike who is a member of the junior staff group. Repeating the same steps here. Great. Now, Mike, who is a member of the junior staff group, is denied access to removable storage devices. And there you have it, folks. In this tutorial, we learned how to create user groups within the sales department and denied them the access to removable storage devices, except for the senior staff. By utilizing these techniques, you can maintain a secure and efficient environment within your organization. If you found this tutorial helpful, be sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to this channel, Hype Tech Official, for more informative content like this. Don't forget to hit the notification bell to stay updated with our latest videos. Thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.